I am a graphic designer and visual artist. I don't really know. I, I would just call myself a creative because I, 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 guess, I guess I do things a little bit differently and I haven't been able to call myself one thing. I am kind of someone that gets inspiration from clothing and gets inspiration from movies and kind of pop culture. So it's something that makes me want to do all of those things at the same time. So I don't really know what you would call me in a way. I'm still figuring it out. Whether I'm sad, whether I'm happy or feeling any type of emotion, I can always rely on art to fall back on. I always feel at home and feel as though I can't do anything wrong when I'm expressing myself in any way. By doing the arts and doing things that I love through art, it just makes me feel like I have something to offer the world and to have that impact and to change something. It's a necessary thing in, in the world for like all people and it, it's something that helps us mentally and spiritually grow. And I think it's something that solidifies us in the world through our struggles and through our daily lives. So for me, it's something that allows me to stay, I guess, calm and to stay collected in my everyday life. And it kind of gives meaning to what I do. And it, it helps me reach out to people, which in return is kind of something that is a little bit rewarding. I think that the arts are important because whether it's helping people reach a state of mind where they're calm and they can reach serenity or it's something that people can rely on to help them through issues like mental issues or things that are going on in their life. I feel like it's just the best outlet for expression and also it brings creativity to the world. There's nothing without art and I think that's something that a lot of people don't realize. When it comes to the arts, that's kind of the icing on the cake. It's, it's the types of people that kind of speak to you spiritually when you go home you want to watch a movie with your friends it, it creates bonds and it and it kind of makes life worth living in a weird way obviously there's a lot of backlash from people who don't support the arts especially from parents or from teachers who don't necessarily understand the types of work that artists do the things that i hear are saying such as it's easy and it's unnecessary irrelevant and, and it's not really helpful in the world and it's just because there's the mentality that artists won't be as successful as say doctors or lawyers or engineers i think it's all coming from a perspective that doesn't see the worth of it and it's, it comes from people who don't understand it which is sad and, and it's sad to me because i feel that it is necessary for everything else that and that kind of happens in the world it, they all kind of feed off each other and art's a big part of that. When I get backlash from people, when they hear that I'm in the arts, that just motivates me to do better and to work harder because there's no point in trying to change their mind by what I say because that's not the type of person that I am. It drives me in a different way to kind of have to prove something. Not only for myself, but for artists in general. And I, I think that's something all artists have in common. I don't say anything to defend myself necessarily. I really just make a point, point blank. This is what I do. You can accept it or you cannot, but that's how I'm going to live and I'm going to be better for it.